Okay. Hello, and welcome to the Greenwood Elementary School production of Frozen Kids. We are so excited to share the hard work that we have been doing with all of you. So please enjoy. Um, this has been a real team effort. We certainly could not have done this without the performers, without their parents, since they're at home and they sometimes need some tech support. Um, and also the amazing volunteers that we have had helping us out with this production. I can't thank them enough. I'm not gonna list them here, but they're all in the program. So please take a look. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We could not have done it without them. I also wanna give a little shout out. Happy birthday to Brian Marr, the father of Sven. Hope you're having a wonderful birthday. From here, just enjoy the show. Please sit back, relax, and enjoy as we transport you to the magical kingdom of Arendelle. Our tale begins a long time ago. In the kingdom of Arendelle, on a beautiful summer day. Once there was a family beloved by all. A king, a queen, two princesses, and the story starts when they were small. One, two, three together, call together, snap together, you and me together, knees together, priest together, up or down together. Well, it's time for bed. Good night. Good night. Elsa, they're gone. Do you want to build a snowman? But we're supposed to be sleeping. But the sky's awake, so I'm awake. So we have to play. Okay, okay. You know, there's a recipe to making a proper snowman. That loves to dream, a part that swings from a tree, a little like me, a little like you, a part that's nice, a part that's naughty too, a, a loyal friend who will stay no matter what, with a big growl belly and a big bouncy butt. He'll love warm hugs and a bright sunlight, but he'll really love summer, but he'll melt. Yeah, you're right. So we'll build him back together. Yes, together, that's the key. Cause he's, he's a little bit of you and me. What do we call him? Um, Olaf. Hi, I'm Olaf, and I like warm hugs. I love love you, Olaf. Okay, time for bed. No, time for more magic, please and thank you. Okay. A little bit of me, you do the math. 
magic can dine Get to see a little bit of fun in the middle of the night When the magic and it all takes place Ow! My head! Mama! Mama! Papa! Help! Elsa, what have you done? It was an accident! Luckily, the queen knew what to do! We need to call the Hidden Folk of the Mountains. The Hidden Folk? Yes, they have healing powers. The Hidden Folk of the Queen's Con came right away. Born with the powers are cursed. Born, and they're getting stronger. You're lucky she did not strike her heart. A heart is not so easily changed, but a head may be persuaded. We are removing all magic. Removing all magic? Yes. Yes, even the magic that fills her memories. To be safe. She'll be all right. Remove my magic too, please. I'm sorry, you can't. Your powers are part of you. But I'm afraid of what I'll do. Then fear will be your enemy. Yes, your fear will cause dangerous ice and snow. We'll protect her. Good. We must leave you now. We bid you well. Goodbye and thank you. Elsa, we'll keep your powers a secret. Mommy? Yes. It's the best for Anna. So the king and queen gave also a pair of gloves to keep her magic inside. They closed the castle gates and limited her contact with people. For years, they kept Elsa's powers hidden from everyone, including Anna. It's snowing, Elsa! Do you want to build a snowman? Come on, let's go and play. I never see you anymore. Come out the door. It's like you've gone away. We used to be best buddies, and now we're not. I wish you would tell me why. Do you want to build a snowman? Doesn't have to be a snowman. Go away, Anna. Okay, bye. I'm doing everything you said, Papa. The ghosts are helping. Good, now again. Conceal it, don't feel it. Don't, don't let, let it, it show. Shine. Do you want to build a snowman? Or ride our bike around the halls? I think some company is overdue. I started talking to the pictures on the walls. Hang in the drone, it gets a little lonely. All these empty rooms, just watching the hours tick. powers for years, but they're getting stronger. Come here, my poor child. No, don't touch me. I don't want to hurt you. Conceal it. Don't feel it. Conceal it. Don't feel it. Anna, it's time. I'm going to miss you. I'm going to be away for a couple of weeks, my sunshine. Please. Do you have to go? Yes, there are answers out there, Elsa. To help you, to help all of us. You'll be fine here. I'll try not to let you down, Father. And with that, the king and queen set off on a dangerous journey. But their ship was overturned by a terrible storm. Did you hear? Did you hear? The king and queen were lost at sea. The king and queen have died? How tragic. As Bishop of Arendelle, I proclaim we shall honor their ways until our young Queen Elsa comes of age. May they rest in peace, those poor daughters all alone. Elsa? I know you're praying there. People are asking where you've been. They have courage, and I'm trying to. I'm right out here for you. Just let me in. We only have each other. It's just you and me, what are we gonna do? Wanna build a
So Anna and Elsa remained apart. Until a few years later when Queen Elsa came of age. Coronation Day, it's Coronation Day. I can't believe they're finally opening up the gates. And for a whole day. It's Coronation Day. Open to Sana. That window's opening. So sad door. I didn't know they that anymore. Who knew we owned a thousand salad plates? For years they've roamed these empty halls. I have a ballroom with no balls. Finally they're opening up the gates. Look at actually real life people. It'll be totally strange. Look, wow, am I so ready for I now present Queen Elsa of Arendelle. Queen Elsa of Arendelle. Hi. Hi. Me? Oh, um, hi. It's been so many years. I've forgotten what a party felt like. Yeah, and what's that amazing smell? Chocolate. And look, there are so many people to meet. Your Majesty's man now presents the Duke of Weaseltown. Weaseltown? It's Weaseltown! <laughs> this is nice, Elsa, being together. Yeah, it is. And maybe we could keep the gates open, let life back in the castle. Wait, no, we can't. But why? I don't understand. That's right. You don't. Can you excuse me for a minute? Of course. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh no, are you okay? I'm fine. How embarrassing. You don't have to be embarrassed in front of me. 
I'm only the thirteenth son of a king. Prince Hans of the Southern Isles. Oh, Princess Anna of Arendelle. You know, not the heir, just as fair. Wait. What? You look upset. Are you okay? I'm fine. My sister also just shut me out again. I'm sorry. I'm used to it. She, she shut me out for years. Oh, Anna. I would never shut you out. Okay, can I just say something crazy? I love crazy. All my life has been a series of joys in my face. And then suddenly I bump into you. I was gonna say thing because like, I've been searching my whole life to find my own place. And maybe it's the party talking or the chocolate fondue. Anna and Hans were excited, and they went to tell us their news. We're getting married! Anna, uh, you can't marry a man you just met. You can if it's true love. What do you know about true love? The party's over. Close the gates. Elsa, wait! Enough, Anna. Give me my glove. No! What are you so afraid of? I said enough! in charge of the Arendelle. How do you know she won't hurt you? Because she is my sister. And so Elsa began to climb the North Mountain, creating more snow. And more snow. And more snow with every step. And it looks like I'm a queen 
summer blizzard and no one can give us room or a barn or even a fish hut yeah what do they have to give things there you got me oh hello i'm princess Anna of arendelle and i could use help finding my sister queen elsa you could use help my name's Kristoff, and i sell ice for a living whoa that doesn't seem profitable right now yeah and your sister went all ice crazy and ruined my whole business. Oh, no. It was my fault. I got engaged to Prince Hans, but Elsa freaked out because I just met him, you know, today. You got engaged with someone you just met? Yes! Why is ever so hung up on that? I have good instincts! Uh-oh. I wouldn't go that way if I were you. Oh, yeah? Which way would you go? Well, the storm's coming from the North Mountain, and I bet your sister's up there, and I know a way how to get up there. Okay, Kristoff, you're hired. Let's go. So did you know your sister could do any of this? I didn't know anything. You know, most people who disappear in the mountains want to be alone. Nobody wants to be alone. Oh. 
A little bit of you, a little bit of me. Ah! Hi, everybody. I'm Olaf, and I like warm hugs. Olaf, did Elsa build you? Yeah. Do you know why? She is? Yeah. Why? Could you lick the way? Yeah. Why? I'll tell you why. We need Elsa to bring back Summer. Summer? I don't know why, but I've always loved the idea of Summer. Really? I'm guessing you don't have much experience with heat. Nope. Bees or buzz. Kids will blow dandelion fuzz. And I'll be doing whatever snow does in summer. A drink in my hand. My snow up against the burning sand. Probably getting gorgeously tanned in summer. Put them together, it just makes sense. Winter's a good time to stay in and cuddle, but put me in summer and I'll be a happy snowman. When life gets too tough, I like to hold on to my dream. A black in the summer sun, just letting off steam. Oh, the sky. Don't you dare. Now come on, let's go bring back summer. Meanwhile, the weather was getting worse and worse. And Tom was worried about Anna, so he formed a search party to find her. Anna! Where are you? Prince Hans, the temperature is dropping. At this rate, we won't survive the night. Princess Anna might be in danger. We must find her. But what of the cold? What of the queen? What if the queen meant to hurt us? Princess Anna left me in charge, Weasel Town. It's Weaselton! And I will not hesitate to protect Arendelle. If the queen really is a monster, then she will be dealt with. Follow me! Back on the North Mountain, Anna, Kristoff, Olaf, and Sven finally made to ice, Elsa's ice palace. Anna went in to talk to her sister, alone. Anna, I'm so happy to see you. But you should probably go. Elsa, I don't want to leave. Anna, I'm trying to protect you. Go home, and you'll be safe from me. Actually, you Kind of set off an eternal winter everywhere. Everywhere? But it's okay. You can just unfreeze it. No, I don't know how. We can face this together, Elsa. I'm not afraid. I'm such a fool. I can't control this curse. Don't panic. I know you can fix this. No, I can't! Anna, are you okay? I'm fine. Anna, I'm begging you. Go, and you'll be safe for me.
Anna, what happened? Elsa accidentally struck me with her powers. I'll be all right. What? Come on. I know some friends who can help. They're healers. Wait, you have friends who are reindeer? Hey. Yes, I have friends. Well, they're my family. They took me and spent in when we had no one. So Kristoff led the way to the hidden folk of the mountains. They were so excited to see Kristoff and meet his friend. Kristoff, our Kristoff's home. Kristoff! Hello. Hi. Look, he brought a girl. Oh, no, no, no. We're not, not a couple. Not a couple? But why? The grumpy way he talks. Hang on now. Or the grumpy way he walks. We need your help. Or the pear shaped, square shaped weirdness of his feet. Wait, what? And though we know he washes well, he always ends up sort of smell. Come on. Now meet a fellow who's a sexy and sweet. We have a problem. Fixer upper, fixer that can fix it. Fixer upper is true. True. Another magic strike. Anna, there is ice in your heart, put there by your sister. If not removed to solid ice, will you freeze forever? Then remove it! If it was your head, we could, but the heart does not so easily let go of its pain. Only an act of true love can thaw a frozen heart. An act of true love? Anna, we've got to get you back to Hans. Come on, quick! Be safe, all of you. Yes, move quickly, but be careful. But Hans himself had just arrived back in Arendelle after capturing Elsa. Moments later, Kristoff brought Anna to Hans. Anna, you've returned! Please, Prince Hans, keep her safe. Hans, Anna first, Elsa froze my heart, and only an act of true love can save me. Oh, Anna, if only there was someone out there who loved you. But you said you did. I lied. As 13 in mind, I knew I had to marry to throne. You were an obvious target. No. Now, what's I tell when you're married? Here it is, Elsa. I am King Hans of Arendelle. 
You are no match for Elsa. You won't get away with this. Oh, I already have. No, 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 no. You can't leave me here alone to die. Please, help! Anna? Olaf? So where's Hans? What happened to your act of true love? I was wrong about him. It wasn't true love. I don't even know what love is. That's okay. I do. Love is playing someone else's needs before yours. Like how Kristoff brought you here back to haunt and left you forever. Kristoff loves me? Wow. You really don't know anything about love, do you? We gotta get you to Kristoff. Quick! Come on! I'll help! So Olaf and Anna went in search of Kristoff. So Prince Hans gathered all the gathered the townspeople. Prince Ar Princess Arnie is dead. She was killed by Queen Elsa. No! By her own sister? How can this be? <gasps> At least we got to say your marriage vows first. Bring in the queen! I charge Queen Elsa with treason! and sentence her to death. No! Elsa broke away, creating triple storm all around. It's a blizzard! I can't see anything! Stay tuned for everyone! Kristoff, are you out here? Anna? Elsa, at last! You can't run from this. Where is my sister? Where is Anna? You froze Anna's heart. Your sister is gone because of you. No! Kristoff! Anna! I speak the end of you! Queen Elsa! Elsa? No!
Congratulations. What a great show, everybody. Thank you for joining us. I hope that you enjoyed the show. We are going to do a little finisher here where the fifth graders are going to tell us a little bit about what they learned and what they enjoyed about this process of creating the show. So if you're a fifth grader, go ahead and leave your camera on. If you're not a fifth grader, you can turn those cameras off. And how about we just start at the top? Lucy, you ready to start us off? Yeah. Um... So I think that Frozen kind of helped me. I think I always wanted to do musical theater and I love musical theater. So I think that this was a good time to kind of socialize and meet other people during COVID, especially on Zoom and perform a fun, perform a fun musical. So, yeah. Thank you, Audrey. I think Frozen like um, like helped me because a lot of fifth grade st stuff got canceled because of COVID, but this still happened and it was a very unique way of doing it that usually in a normal year would not have happened this way, but we made it work. Great, Amina. Yeah, I like Audrey. Like, um, it's a different way of having musical theater than it usually is like, in person but it's still really fun and like still getting to like great st stuff got canceled friends. because of COVID. thank you eva um like the past few people said i agree it's just a really fun um way to socialize with your friends and i agree with audrey we missed fifth graders miss Slav. Um, stuff that you'd usually do in person like Islandwood and a couple other things and we can't have graduation like in the school but at, but this was just a really fun time to socialize and it's just a really fun musical to do so yeah. Benji. I think this was just like a really fun time to interact with other people and friends because like COVID happened and we weren't able to go to Ironwood or do other things. And this was like a fun process of making a cool, awesome show. And this was also like the first year I got a big role in uh, musical theater and stuff. So I was really excited about that. And I like, yeah, that was just like what I learned and stuff, but yeah. Luke. Um, I think it's fun because it's a, it's a way to socialize with people you never like hang out with or you never connect with and you just meet new people and it's really, en I enjoy it. And yeah. Chloe. Um, I have definitely been able to like, since we can't like see each other in like real life, well, in school, like it's like a really fun new way to express yourself because some people not might not know like that you like to do acting or you like to sing and like you get to show them that you love to do that. And it's also like super fun to do it with like your fellow classmates. And like everyone said, like we've missed a bunch of stuff, but this has been like one of the things that like has kept me happy because it's just like so much fun and you can look forward to it all week. And it's just amazing doing it with all your friends. Gabby. Um, I learned that to pretend, um, I'm like, that's happening in real life because then it helps me act and, um, that's really helpful. And like Eva said, uh, a lot of things got canceled, but I'm happy we still got to do like musical theater online, which was really fun. And like, this is my first time doing it and it was super fun and I'm definitely going to do acting again. So, yeah. Wonderful. Luca. Well, one of the things I learned is that um, doing a whole like musical theater performance and learning and everything on Zoom is hard, but it's still really fun. And I just had a really fun experience doing this. I mean, I've gotten like a higher role than I've gotten before, even though I only have about five or six lines. I mean, this is still my favorite show I have ever done, so. Thank you, Sonia. Um, yeah, adding on to everyone, this is just such a fun event and fifth grade, you should try new things 
And I've done musical theater before, but it's still just so much fun. And it's just fun. Thank you, Harry. Um, like Sonia said, it's just fun. And like, you should like try new things and like, just, just try new things. Even though we're on Zoom, it's still as fun as it was in person. So like, yeah, just good job. Emily. Well, I think it's been really nice to be able to see people already in school because it's just nice to be able to socialize. And also there's a lot of amazing actors and actresses that are here and amazing directors. So it's nice to feel like to be in a really encouraging environment. Thank you, Gus, take it home. Okay, well, the thing I love about it is like, I've been super, a bunch of plays on top of my actually. I, it's just so fun to see how they come together. And it's, I've been a bad guy think, kind of two times because I was the um, dog catcher in uh, donations. That wasn't really a bad guy, but I've never really played a bad guy. It was really fun to kind of be evil and be mean to people. And I'm just, it was just super awesome and fun to and like play this part. And I really enjoyed it. And also, thank you, Kate, for directing. That's... You are welcome. Um, everybody turn your cameras on one more time and we'll wave goodbye to our amazing audience out there. Everybody, cameras on. Congratulations on your opening night. Thank you, everybody, for coming and watching. And we're back again tomorrow on Sunday. So if you want to see the show again, come back on Sunday. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye. 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 B